hey guys welcome back to my channel and welcome back to the weekend vlog it is currently saturday i am getting ready for work yeah so this weekend is actually a really long weekend uh today's spiritual baptist yesterday which was friday was easter friday then easter sunday and we have easter monday so yeah long long weekend so let's have a great fun weekend um so as i said i have work today later we're heading to a one of our friends birthday party and yeah this weekend i don't have no plans for this weekend this weekend is pretty chill so if there's anything i will see you guys a little later yeah guys so one more thing that i forgot to ask you guys do you all go to Saparia to the church where they have the la la Vina pastoral um and like you go and you you give offerings to her and you pray and you ask her for what you want and she gives it to you in return like grew up um hearing about it and like before covid had started dean and parents and dean and i had went and you know you just go to the church and you pray you see her you give her money i think you have to buy sweet oil and carry it and you know um make like a little offering i can't remember really how it goes and then after once you finish that there is like a bunch of homeless people um sitting on the ground like man woman child and you just walk around and you give out money to the homeless people there food or what else clothing once in my entire life and yeah it's really really touching if you read up the history about la ravina pastora you would you would understand um you'll understand more about it so i would link an article in the description. link to one of the history there are many histories but i think this one is like the most accurate about how she came how she came to trinidad how she's been acknowledged and what what she does for people and all of that a lot, like a lot of people all ethnicity goes um to her to pray um i know i heard a lot of stories about women who cannot conceive or they went to her and they sat and they pray and they asked for her to bless them with a child and a lot of um a lot of people that i've heard personally got pregnant that way and i know some people would be, would be like mm, i don't believe in that i find it really interesting so i know if you guys went if you ever went and if you are interested in going next year because i was just curious to know if any one of you know about that yeah leave it in the comments down below and again don't forget to check out the link that i'll put to the to the history about la ravina pastora all right yeah okay bye <laughs> that thing hits like some fresh ginger tea that's some um bath and body wallflowers from shoppers anonymous oh you yeah, know as my girl i always shop with her i think the wallflowers were like 45 or, or 50 dollars i think it's 50. i wanted to show you guys what i got two cents as well for the spa and also for my house um my total was 325 and i think it was six wallflower items so this is the bag here all right so yeah it's six. a new scent um that i got and some are like repurchase scents so the first scent is pink lavender and espresso this is a new fragrance and it's treats plus sweets i don't know what i mean but the fragrance notes in this is pink rich lavender caramel espresso beans smooth vanilla I have time to open up all this individually so i'm just like you know sharing the notes with you guys the other one is fresh sheets this is fresh cotton i love this scent this is a repurchase the fragrance notes is italian bergamot and fresh musk this is a really nice scent the other one is fiji white sun again this is clean and fresh 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 cut sugar cane white nectar and sandalwood hmm, sounds interesting so that's that then this one is a new one called spring clothesline fresh and clean this one has lemon water sun dry blossom and golden amber hmm. divine and the last two scents 
that I got is Stress Relief, which is like my favorite scent of them all. This is basically eucalyptus and spearmint and such a relaxing scent. So it comes in a pack of two. So um, yeah, that's all that I got. And I saw that she gifted me a hand sanitizer, a lavender and vanilla. smells divine so all the items that i got at shoppers anonymous guys so yeah i think for the spa because i have to um change a wallflower there i think i'm gonna use eucalyptus and spearmint yeah stress relief eucalyptus and spearmint so oh yeah when i say i want tea this is how much tea i want this is ginger tea by the way but yeah this is how much tea I want, okay? <laughs> much, much, much later. So Caribe came out with a pear cycle. I don't really know I had to give it a try. I love anything pear related, pear flavor. So yeah, let's try this. It's 4.5% alcohol. So wow, that's a lot. This would be like a prosecco, but it's pear flavored. I have a mint, so I need to spit this out. Yes. Mmm. Okay, so I had a mint in my mouth, so I can't really taste anything beside the fact that I feel like I'm getting brain freeze because if, if you ever had mint and drink cold water, it's gonna sound how I'm feeling right now. But yeah, I feel like I can't taste anything. I'm tasting the pear flavor and I'm tasting like, you know, Prosecco is kind of like dry. I'm tasting the dryness of that, so. Mm. It's good. It's not too sweet. Mm. It's really good. I like it. I like it a lot. And hey, you look at the color of that cloud now. My God, it is thunder like rain, ha ha ha. But in all seriousness, we need our little rain air. This place is sickening hot. Men not able, you know. We're heading to Clifton Hill for our little chill vibe. A 
way you look at people now. You make me wanna not jump around the place, ha 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 ha, ah, you know that song? I tried this Clifton Hill cocktail was damaged. It got the job done, ha ha. Then I switched to my Prosecco. You check part of the team, Haha and Lonali, Kevin and Britney big up on you, Holly self. <laughs> <laughs>